I'm Bahati. Nice Going to, to be you. the nurse taking care of you today. Bahati Maganjo says her passion for working in healthcare was fueled by the reality of war. Constantly, I would think if war broke out where I am, what would I have to contribute? Born just weeks before the 1994 Rwandan genocide, she lived her entire life in Kenya as a refugee. That is, until she came to Nova Scotia to be a healthcare worker two years ago. Just take deep breaths, okay? She was one of the very first under a new federal program designed to recruit skilled refugees to help ease Canada's shortage of workers. But many more are still waiting. I know what it feels like, you know. I know that someone's life stops. I actually don't know when I will actually go. We first introduced you to Patricia Kamsor last month. She's a refugee in Kenya and has been waiting to come to Canada for more than two years. She has a job offer to work at this new nursing home in Mahone Bay, but she can't come until she gets her permanent residency from the federal government. So now we're coming to a corridor. Tina Henniger is the company's settlement coordinator. She says people here know they need health care workers and we're excited to welcome them. But the workers should have already been here by now. You know, some of the community members as well are maybe seem a little skeptical, like, is this actually going to happen? What do you know about the reasons for the delay? I believe it's in the hands of our federal partners with IRCC. Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada says it aims to process the majority of cases linked to this program within six months, but that cases may be delayed for a variety of reasons. I find myself wanting to tell them to just hang in there. Maganjo is calling on the government to see the urgency in the people still waiting. And thank you very much for what you've done. Oh, you're most welcome. Yeah. As well as the desperate need okay. for more healthcare workers in this country. Kayla Hounsel, CBC News, New Glasgow, Nova Scotia.